13 Action News Update sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. Hello, I'm Dave Corvassi, and right now in your 13 Action News Update, Las Vegas Metro Police say an officer has died due to complications from COVID-19. Metro posting on Twitter saying, Officer Phil Closey was an incredibly dedicated family man, a volunteer coach. He worked at the Metro Police Department for 21 years. He was 48 years old. If you'd like to help out the officer's family during this difficult time, you can head over to our website, ktnv.com. The Roman Catholic Diocese of Las Vegas says it will not be issuing religious exemptions for COVID-19 vaccine requirements. Bishop Leo Thomas sent out a message to all the parishes in the diocese. He says the decision is in accordance with the Pope's comments over the past several months. Pope Francis encouraged Catholics to get vaccinated. The bishop added religious exemptions would contradict the Pope and has advised priests in the Las Vegas Diocese to not issue letters of exemption. Las Vegas has a brand new sports team, the Vegas Nighthawks, our new indoor football team. The team will play in Henderson at the newly constructed Dollar Loan Center next season. They also announced Mike Davis will be the coach. He was the defensive line coach for the Toronto Argonauts of the Canadian Football League. We'll keep an eye on some wildfire smoke for the next few days. Uh, air quality this morning is moderate, so we're doing OK. Some smoke today with some thicker smoke tomorrow. Climbing through the 80s this morning, mid 90s at noon and our second afternoon where we are back in the triple digits with a forecast of 103. 104 Wednesday, 105 Thursday. Dave, the heat's going to peak Friday into Saturday right around 107. That's toasty for late August. It is. All right, that was your 13 Action News update. You'll find more on our website, ktnv.com and our free mobile app.